you know, the reality is, as many of you know, now, you, at, at the beginning, you thought, oh, this will be a breeze. A year or two later, you'll be there, right? That's how you thought. And then five years later, some of you are going, yeah, maybe it's not such a breeze after all. Isn't it that how it is? And, um, and so you realise how strongly entrenched we are in our own addictive behaviour and how strongly entrenched we are in gaining the approval of the world that surrounds us that, that we're often very stuck when it comes to progressing in love towards God. And, and so, you know, what we originally conceived, how easy it might be to do so, and later, of course, we find out that it takes some time, particularly on the earth, to progress towards God in an environment that is so negative and cynical, uh, particularly cynical about God, and particularly cynical about love, in fact. There's a lot of cynicism about love and God and as a result it's quite difficult to progress on earth because you're just constantly surrounded by this cynicism. And then of course as you know from a few, well about, it must be nearly 12 months ago now, we had that talk about positively responding to spirit influence. You remember that talk that we gave? And the reason why we gave that talk was because we be believe that a lot of people are getting heavily influenced by spirits without being really aware and in fact, uh, we've, to we've talked to spirits who say they play you like a puppet. So they say that generally many of the people who come along, they are just playing like a puppet. You know, they're just triggering a certain addiction and before they know it, the person goes off and does something that's out of harmony with love without even thinking and a lot of times being influenced by the spirits to do so. And... Um, and so, you know, we find that there's a lot of that kind of influence going on. And of course, the longer you don't deal with something, the worse it gets. So, you know, if you deal with something straight away, you know, there's a very short period of time when you have a bad experience, generally. But if you hold on to it, delay it, do, you know, try to drag it on for years and years and years, you don't want to face certain things for a long period of time. And this is part of the problem that many of you are experiencing now you drag out the process and you get hammered by not only people on earth but people in the spirit world all that time to change your mind. And that uh, takes a lot of energy out of you. You know, it makes you feel tired, exhausted and all those kind of feelings. A lot of those feelings come from this feeling that you're in a long, drawn-out fight with negativity. And the reality is the only thing that's drawing out the fight is the lack of humility to your own emotion but but most of the time we don't see it as that so this is some of the things I'd like to talk to you about today so 